Hey guys, Brandon here. I thought it might be helpful to make a quick video tutorial on how you can make a promo for WPA in Audacity. So Audacity is an audio editing and recording software uh, freeware for Windows and Mac. And it can do pretty much everything we need to make a promo. So uh, the three, three main steps of producing a promo are recording the voice audio, um, editing that audio, and mixing in the music bed. So three steps. So I have the voice here where I say um, the show name, show time, and WP Exeter and everything. And if I drag that in, it'll import into this project. And so that's what the waveform looks like. Uh, you can see it's around 18 and a half seconds long. And here we want to clean it up a bit. So this part looks all good. Uh, it's at a good level here. But here it's clipping a bit. And that's bad because it means that um, we hit the max loudness and there's there'll be some distortion um, so let's take a quick listen hi I'm Brandon Liu huh? so it's not too bad but um, it's a bit louder than everything else so if we want to selectively bring down the loudness of a certain part we can use the envelope tool for that so I'll start by zooming in using the magnifying glass just so I can see that section and then I'll use the envelope tool to create some anchor points so click twice before there and click two more anchors at the end. And then using the inner anchor points, you can bring down the loudness of that. And it just shrinks the waveform. Um, so now if we listen to that again. Hi, I'm Brandon Liu, class of 20. It's not too bad. Um, and to unzoom and to see the full view of the track, do Command F. So the rest of the editing process would mostly be um, isolating and removing any artifacts in the audio so like breaths clicks and pops and removing any empty space that you think is unnecessary so for example here um, there's some there's a breath music you're li so I'll zoom in here so I'll listen in and if you select that portion the portion where there's a breath you can command L and that'll silence that part and if it's a bit long, you can always delete some silence. So, so tighten up that gap. Alt Indian rock music. You're listening to WPA exit. And so you can go ahead and repeat that wherever you think is necessary, just to clean up the audio. Adjusting the levels like we did with the envelope tool as well. And if you need to re-record a section too, um, you could um, simply delete a section and record over it and it'll record into a new track and then repeat the editing process. So at this point I think we look uh, this track looks pretty good. Uh, we want to normal we want to um, render it now into a new track. So you go to tracks, mix and render and that will take this whole track and finalize all the edits we've made. After that, uh, let's amplify it so we're at a good loudness level. And so we use effect amplify. I'll go to this menu and set the peak amplitude to negative one, which basically means that uh, the loudest it'll get. So like, for example, this probably this peak right here, this peak will be amplified. So it's negative one decibels from where it would clip. And so when I hit OK, you can see it'll all expand and that'll go up pretty high. And so now the voice track is all edited and we're ready to mix in the music bed. So we can go ahead and drag in the music bed into Audacity. It'll import it. And close that up. So if we want a 30 second promo, we can cut out the whole end and just cut it up to 30 seconds. Um, and you can use the middle of the song if you'd like, whatever part. Uh, for this one, I'll just use the beginning. And now I'll show, I'll expand it horizontally, Command F to fit the whole screen. And here uh, we're going to use two tools, Time Shift and Envelope. So click the arrow tool, the Time Shift tool to move the speaking part into the middle of the track. And I'll move the speaking part right before it gets a little bit louder here. And then we'll use the Envelope tool to selectively make um, the music bed quieter where I'm speaking. 
And so it's the same idea as what we we're doing earlier. So we'll set two anchors here, two more anchors here, a little space between them. And if we bring that down and bring this one down as well, it'll fade down when I start speaking and then fade back up when I finish. And to fade out the track, one option is to create two more anchor points here and the second one drag it out so it fades out at the end. And let's give it a listen, see how it sounds. Hi, I'm Randon Liu, class of 2017 at Phillips Exeter Academy and former general manager of WPEA. Join me and Ali Hassani Sundays from 5 to 6 for the radio department, where we play the best in alt, indie, and rock music. You're listening to WPEA Exeter. Nice. So, that sounds pretty good. And uh, when you're editing, feel free to move these points around, see what sounds best, um, re-amplify portions, or add some effects. There's plenty of effects in Audacity. But at this point, I think we're ready to finalize and export audio. And that's the last step. So you save your audio file. And just make sure to save it as a WAV file because that's lossless, high quality audio. And that's it. Uh, just replace that. Save. And I hope that was helpful. Uh, this is one way to do it. I'm sure there's many others using Adobe Audition or some other software, but uh, I've had pretty good success use, doing it this way. And feel free to reach out if you need any help or anything. Uh, best of luck. Thanks, everyone.